update. Hey gang, update 29. Last week a lot of you thought that maybe I was on drugs. And I want to thank you for your concern. I was on a drug. I was on caffeine. So thank you for your concern, but no need to be concerned because I'm fine. I just have a lot of work to do over here and in my day job life. A little uh, progress update. I have spent my editing time since we finished shooting on the most technically difficult scene in the entire episode. Every shot is an effect shot, whether it looks like it or not. Since then, I have accomplished 1 minute and 15 seconds of effects shots. Rotoscoping takes forever. And so today I said, I, I got into the afternoon working on it and I thought, I am going to go crazy. So I, I decided to uh, stop working on effect shots and just take it from the beginning of the episode. So today I also finished the previously on and I started working on the intro, which looks super awesome! So that's very exciting. After you work on effect shots for a while and then you go into regular editing, it's such a relief to see progress happening second by second as opposed to frame by frame, which is what happens during effects and it's a nightmare, but uh, a nightmare that's worth it if you like effects shows, which I do a lot, which is why this is one. As for the question last week, what gets you guys amped and working on a project? A lot of people said music. Music was also the most relaxing a few weeks ago. Music wins for most relaxing. <laughs> and this time, music is what gets you going. I also use music when I'm editing, and especially when I'm doing effects, you need music in order to feel like you're not stuck in one tiny little second, frame by frame, keyframe by keyframe. And a lot of people added the qualifier metal. Metal music gets them going. A lot of people agreed with me on coffee. A lot of people said being inspired is what gets them going on a project, and that's fair enough, but inspiration will only take you so far, and then you have to accomplish things by sheer force of will. And a lot of people said procrastinating to the last possible second made them accomplish things, which, fair enough, it's just not a very good habit to get into. I, myself, was a huge procrastinator, and still am, when it comes to things that actually matter, like I would say, uh, cleaning, cleaning the apartment is something that I procrastinate as much as possible and then complain about while I do it. And my wife loves that. Homework. Homework was a big one when I was in high school. I have maybe four memories of doing homework throughout all of high school. I know I must have done more because I graduated and I didn't do too badly. But you guys should do your homework. I know a lot of you guys are still in school um, and that's important, I'm sure. And I also got a comment here which said, updates, 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 so many updates. I don't even remember what your updating is about. These are boring. This is an update for Pops. You can see it right up there, Pops Update 29. And Pops is a acronym for the Platoon of Power Squadron. At one point you liked it, you subscribed to it, it has Wheezy Waiter in it, so stick around. If you don't want to watch the updates, please don't watch the updates. Anytime you see me appear in the subscription box with an update, that means the episode's not done yet. Eventually the trailer for episode 4 will show up, and then the episode. So until you see Pops F4 Part 1 or F4 Trailer, just kind of tune me out and you can enjoy the show. The updates are for the people who just want to stay in the loop. Also, for those of you who are interested, on the next TV blog, I'm going to start doing a no-budget filmmakers blog. I'm going to be posting about once a week. So there's a link to that in the dupes. Check it out if you want, otherwise don't. So my question for this week is very simple. Here in Illinois, fall has arrived. I actually like that a lot. Fall is my favorite season here in the Midwest because it's very colorful. It's nice and cool so that uh, you can get the sweatshirts back out, start layering. I have a lot of hooded sweatshirts and I like them a lot. And I like Halloween. I like the fun that Halloween is. I don't like All Hallows Eve necessarily, um, but I do like what Halloween has become, which is taking things that are very spooky and then kind of like having fun with it. And I also kind of think that we are kind of conditioned from youth to enjoy the season uh, that has our birthday in it. So I don't know how much of my enjoyment of fall comes with the conditioning of youth and how much comes from the other things that I mentioned. But what's your favorite season and why? So let me know in the comments and I have a lot of work to do here in this computer area. So I will get to it and I will see you next week.